images God has created? Yes. And do you do so willingly and without any reservations? And do you promise to be faithful to Baron, to love him and nurture him, and give yourself only to him? I want you to face each other. Baron and Waikiki have pinned their own words and their own vows to each other. And so now they will re repeat them to one another. Words written from their hearts. So Baron, you'll be first. Okay? You ready? <laughs> I was thinking it was going to be a simple repeat after me. And I do. Thanks to Google, I think I have some assistance. So here it goes. Hi, Baron. Higgy Waiki. To, my, to be my OCD wedded wife, my constant travel partner, my color coordinated partner, and my love from this day forward. In the presence of everyone, our family and friends, I offer to you my eternal vow to be your ADHD dependent, <laughs> in sickness and in quarantine, in good times and in pickleball losses, as well as in any HDS hot dog and stick emergency. <laughs> <laughs> Promise to you to drive you crazy, frustrate, annoy you unconditionally, and to always open more businesses. <laughs> you make me feel loved and cared for, and most importantly, wonderful. I look forward to the next 25 years of our lives in New York. <laughs> That's the Google version, but I do have. Writer. <laughs> Waikiki is. Uh, Waikiki, as cheesy as you completely sounds, that face cannot be so true. I cook, you clean up after me. I have an easy job starting the laundry and then you fold and hang it to your liking. From me starting hot dog on a stick. And then you're stuck doing scheduling, HR, inventory, payroll, inventory, and pretty much everything else. Then opposites attract, which couldn't be more true as well. I'm quite messy, but at least now you have me trained to wipe down the sink and faucet after every use. I'm an animal lover, and well, yes, everyone, somebody's leaving with two cats today. <laughs> I'm so lucky to have a detailed, logical, smart wife to keep me in check. You're there as I start my ventures, project hobbies, and all my craziest things that I do, and I couldn't do it without you. I'm so lucky that you can put up with me, keep up with me, and always be there for me. My key, I, almost, I always will be there and look forward to the travels and adventures that we're about to embark on. I love you very much. I Baron John Obata. I have chosen you, Waikiki Chan, from all, world, from all the world to be my wife. For better or for worse, for sure or poor, sickness and health, for as long as we both shall live. So, obviously, when planning weddings, the groom has sort of the easier task, right? So he had the luxury of preparing a poster board and actually even printing out on paper. I only took it on my phone because I didn't have a chance to go to a printer. Actually, yeah, with, with my cohorts there. So, there it goes. Okay. It's so cliche to marry your best friend but after growing our friendship for 27 years, not 25, I feel like we know each other better than many newlyweds. 
And after living life independently for so many years, I feel we know ourselves better too. It is because of that time and experience that I have the perspective to stand here today, totally confident in our relationship. Some people ask why we waited so long, but the journey made us into who we are today. Two complete people who came full circle and who made a conscious decision to choose each other in ways big and small every day. It wasn't until now that we were the right people at the right time and the right place. And we're lucky enough that although we are not a couple until recently, our whole adult lives, we have been friends. I promise to never take I promise to never take your company for granted and to always seek to balance that comes from the way we compliment each other. I promise to make schedules and cost analysis charts when you open new businesses. Uh, uh, I promise, but I guess I will. I promise to respect your spaces unless you're too messy and to triple check that everything is appropriately cleaned to my criteria. I promise to attempt to touch animals, but only on vacation. I promise to laugh uncontrollably with you over nothing. I promise to stay open to the possibilities and potential that you see in everything. And when you say, we go, and I'll say, why not? I, Y.T. Chan, have chosen you, Baron John Obata, from all the world, to be my husband, for better or better, richer and richer, clean and cleaner, successful and even more successful businesses, in sickness and in health. I will tenderly care for you and our family as long as we both shall live. Now to be constant reminders of the promises that you've made today. You will give each other your wedding rings. Now your wedding rings are more than jewelry. They represent the promises that you've made. The wedding rings are to be worn only on your left hand because the left hand is the hand that is closest to your heart. Your wedding ring is made out of precious metal. Mined from the earth for which God created, which reminds all of us and you that your marriage is very precious to each other and also to God. Whenever you, whenever and wherever you are, when you look at your rings, it will remind you of the promises that you've made, the vows that you shared with each other. And no matter where you are, you will keep, your rings will keep both of you close to each other's hearts. So may I have the rings, please? let us pray a blessing upon these rings. Almighty God, we bring before you these very special rings. These rings are more than jewelry. These rings represent love, promises, and the marriage that is shared today. We also ask for your blessing upon these rings, the giving of them and the receiving of them. May these rings never be, never be tarnished or soiled by all the love and promises that they represent. Amen. Baron, I want you to take this ring, place it on the fourth finger of Waikiki's left hand. Stop right there. Stop right there. <laughs> Waikiki, I give, I give you this ring, a true symbol of my love, commitment, and dedication to you our marriage, our family. Place it on the fourth finger of his left hand. Baron, I give you this ring, a true symbol of my love, my commitment, and dedication to you, our marriage, and our family. So 
Ito ay pulik ako, let us pray. Almighty God, love is alive today. <clears throat> for these two have come before you in this celebration of marriage. They have come here to ask for your blessing. The blessings of God and the blessings of their family upon this marriage. They have pledged before you and their ohana to live together in sacred marriage. So let their love and their marriage grow true and beautiful, just as the beauty that surrounds us today. Clothe them in compassion so they may bear one another's burdens with strength and patience. Warm them with kindness so that the chill winds of selfishness and blame may never blow between them. Grant them laughter and joy to gracefully smooth over all life's rough spots and lead them along the paths of peace and prosperity. And above all, grant them growth in love so that their marriage, their lives, their family may honor you and be an inspiration to all. Amen. Aaron John Obata, YT Chan. You have made your intents known today. You have made your promises and your vows to one another before God and your family and friends gathered here today. So as minister of the gospel here in the state of Hawaii and by the authority given to me, it gives you great pleasure to pronounce you as husband and wife. And what God has joined together, let no one separate. Now, Baron, can you show all of us how much you love your wife and seal this with a kiss? Do it, Baron. Please stand. Everyone, it gives you great pleasure to be the first to present to all of you, Mr. and Mrs. Baron and Waiki Obata. Congratulations! Yeah. <laughs> 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 